So we'll begin seated. So get yourself comfortable. Just relax the sit bones and your legs. Roll your shoulders back a few times. And allow your shoulders to just rest on your back. And just rest your palms on your thighs. Feel your spine nice and tall. Gentle tug to the top of your head. And just close your eyes or find a soft gaze. And we'll begin with some Pilates breaths. So breathe in through your nose, allow your ribs to expand and exhale through pursed lips like you're blowing out a candle. <sighs> Inhaling, feel those ribs expanding. And exhale through pursed lips. <sighs> Inhale. Do a few more of those on your own time. Inhaling, feel that expansion. Exhale through those pursed lips. We'll do one more breath here together, inhaling and exhaling. And just coming onto your back. Knees are bent, feet are on the ground, arms by your side. And we'll just warm up the shoulders. So inhale, bring your arms to the ceiling. Exhale, they come over your head in the shape of a V. As you exhale, sweep them around on the floor like a snow angel. Inhale, return. Exhale, over. Inhale. And then as you exhale, just note the broadness of your shoulders ribs staying knitted to your tummy. Inhale, exhale. And returning back to the ceiling, we'll reverse the direction. Inhale your arms down. Exhale, they sweep around. Inhale down. Exhale around. And one more, inhale, and exhale. And then just bring your arms by your side, and we'll begin some pelvic rocking. You can put your hands on your hip bones, and then just feel your back flattening on the mat, and then feel your hips going towards the ceiling. So just a rocking into that pelvis, Releasing that lower lumbar spine. Keeping that tailbone heavy and on the ground. And then just come to your regular resting point. Finding neutral imprint, you can bring the heels of your hands on your hips and form a triangle. Inhale. And as you exhale through those pursed lips, feel your hands sinking in obliques turning on to keep a small space still, still behind your back. Inhale, relax. Exhale, zip it up like you're putting on jeans too tight. Inhale, relax. And one more. Exhale, zipping up. Inhale, relax. And this time we'll stay in the imprint. So exhale, 
Feel that imprint, return your hands by your side, keeping that imprint, bring your legs to tabletop. Take an inhale here, exhale, tap right toe down. Inhale, returns. Exhale, left toe down. Inhale, returns. Keeping this going, you can put your thumb in your lower rib and your middle finger on your hip bone to tell your body to keep those obliques turned on. Soften your shoulders. One more on each side. Exhale as it comes down. Inhale, it returns. Exhale, down. Inhale, returns. Staying in tabletop. Make sure you're still in your imprint. Take an inhale. Squeeze your legs together, and then they both come down. Inhale, return. Exhale, they come down. If you're feeling a curve in your spine, don't bring your feet down all the way. So as soon as you feel like you're losing that imprint, return the legs to tabletop. Squeeze those inner thighs, inhale. Exhale, they come down. Inhale, return. And with your next exhale, just return those feet hip distance apart and on the ground. And just warming up the neck muscles. Take an inhale, just nod that chin slightly to your chest. Exhale, release. Head is on the ground the whole time. Inhale, just nod the chin. Exhale, release. And one more. Inhale, just nod that chin. Exhale, release. And we'll put that all together with the ab prep. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, flex your head, neck, arms off the mat, working right over those knees. Inhale. Exhale, come back down. Relax head, arms, shoulders completely. Inhale, just nod your head. Exhale, purse lips, lifting up. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, flex up. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down. Now bring your hands behind your head. See your elbows. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, flexing up. Careful not to jam the chin to the chest. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, flex up. Look right over those knees. Drop your shoulders. Inhale. Exhale, come back down. One more. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, flex up. Inhale, come a little higher. Exhale, come back down. Relax and turn over onto your belly for the breaststroke warm up. So your legs are either together or slightly apart. Your arms are at a W, your head is hovering. Pull your belly button to your spine, engage your glutes. Inhale. Exhale, press into the hands and forearms to lift that heart. Keeping that head in line with the spine. Inhale. Exhale, return to hover. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, lifting. Bring your shoulders away from your ears. Inhale. Exhale, come back down. One more like this. Inhaling. Exhale, press up. Inhale, stay. Exhale, return to hover. Now bring one hand on top of the other and then glue your forehead to those hands and you'll come up as a unit. So belly button to spine, glutes engage. Inhale, exhale, come up. 
Inhale, you stay. Exhale, come back down. Inhale. Exhale, come up. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down. One more. Inhale. Exhale, come up. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down. And press yourself into your child's pose. Spread your fingers. Reach those arms long. And relax into that lower back. And then your forehead comes to the mat. Take a nice deep inhale here. Feel your ribs expanding. Exhale it all out. One more breath here. Inhale. And then exhale, just slowly coming up and returning onto your back for the hundred. Okay, so for the hundred, if you have head, neck, shoulder pain, just keep your head down. Your legs will be in tabletop, but wait until it keys into imprint and your arms pump parallel. That's level one. Level two will be here and level three will be here. Just careful with that chin. So let's get into imprint and get started. Take an inhale, exhale through those pursed lips, feel that imprint, tabletop legs. Choose whether you're coming up, and begin. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Take a big inhale. And your exhale brings you back down. Squeeze your knees into your chest. Breathing deeply. And rock a little side to side. And then we'll come up to a seat for the half roll back. Feet are on the ground, spine is tall, arms out parallel. Take an inhale, exhale, you're gonna squeeze the glutes first as you roll halfway back. Inhale, stay. Exhale, imagining there's a beach ball as you keep that curve as you roll back over. Inhale, exhale, squeeze, come back. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back over. Inhale, exhale, squeeze, come back. Drop those shoulders, inhale. Exhale, keep that curve as you roll back. You're going to add the arms. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze, come back. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, parallel. Inhale, overhead. Exhale, parallel. One more. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, parallel. Keep that curve. Come back over, rest your hands on your knees, and just relax. And then come onto your back for the roll up. If during the roll up, when you come to here and you get stuck, you can kind of use those elbows to help shimmy you up. So arms begin over your head, legs straight. Inhale, arms to ceiling. Use that exhale to come up and over. Take an inhale into the stretch. 
And then exhale, squeeze those glutes, shoulders back and down, coming back with control. Arms return overhead and they repeat. Inhale to ceiling. Exhale up and over. Inhale, stay. Exhale, come back down with control. Arms overhead. Inhale to ceiling. Exhale. Up and over. Inhale here. Exhale, come back down. Shoulders back and down. One more. This time we'll stay up. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, feel that stretch. And then exhale to stack your spine. Good. I'm just moving into the twist. So you can either sit cross-legged or with your legs out in front of you. Just as long as you can keep this tall back. Arms out to a T. Drop your shoulders. Take an inhale. And then exhale to the right a little bit. A little bit more. And a little bit more. Inhale, return center. Exhale, left. 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 Inhale, center. Think that you have a spring. So right, right, right. Inhale, center. Exhale, left, left, left. Inhale, center. Exhale, right, right, right. Inhale, center. Exhale, left, left, left. Inhale, center. One more each side. Exhale, right, right. Right, inhale, center. Exhale, left, left, left. Inhale, center. Relax your arms. Come back onto your back for an ab series. All of these will be done in imprint. Take an inhale. As you exhale, feel that imprint scooping into that belly. Tabletop legs, lifting your head, shoulders up off the mat, begin to straighten one leg and then the other, and then your hands catch the knee as it comes in. And the breath is like this. Track that quad into that knee. Careful not to jam that chin to chest. Keep up with that breath. Pause at tabletop, hands behind the head. Legs do the same thing, but now you're just tipping one elbow to the floor and then the one to the other side. Keep that pelvis nice and stable. Don't jam that chin to the chest. Breathe. A couple more. Mask one to the right, go slow. And go slow to the left. And take a breather, squeeze those knees in. Inhaling and exhaling. Bend and stretch your legs a few times. Loop up those hamstrings. And we'll work into the scissors. So find what straight is for you, point your toes, lifting head, shoulders, arms off the mat, and then pulse your legs away from each other. So look at your toes as they come in. That way you're keeping your head in line.
little longer. One more right. One more left. And relax. Squeeze knees in and breathe. Bring your feet on the ground, hip distance apart, and we'll work into the bridge series. So your heels are a little closer in. Make sure your knees stay inside and not fall open or not knee. Take an inhale. Exhale, squeeze into the glutes first. And you're gonna peel one vertebrae at a time off the mat. Once you get to the top, take an inhale, and then exhale with control. One vertebrae at a time comes to the mat, keeping those glutes fired. Inhale at the bottom. Exhale, squeeze, glutes rolling up. You can even put your hands or fingers at your hip bones. Take an inhale, and as you exhale, you can just watch the pelvis coming down nice and easy and even. And we'll do one more inhale. Exhale, squeeze those glutes rolling up. Inhale at the top. Exhale with control coming down. Good, now we'll do a few hip hinges. So take an inhale, exhale, squeeze, glutes just hinge up. Inhale, hinge down, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale, hinge up. Inhale down, exhale, hinge up. Inhale down. This time we'll stay, exhale, squeeze, glutes, hinge up, moving into the full bridge. Inhale, then exhale, lift right heel, right toe, point that leg straight to the ceiling, then bring it parallel to your other leg, then point, return back to the ceiling, parallel to the other leg, point to ceiling, parallel to the other leg, point to ceiling, Bend that leg, bring it down. Reorient those hips, inhale. Exhale, lift left heel, left toe. Point that toe to the ceiling. Leg comes parallel to the leg. Inhale, point to ceiling. Exhale, flex up foot, bringing it down parallel. Inhale, point. Exhale, parallel. One more, inhale, point. Bend that knee, bring it down. Inhale, lift those hips. And then exhale with control, rolling one vertebrae at a time down to the mat. And once you return here, just windshield wiper those legs. Just let that all go. Check in with your breath. And then we're going to come onto our belly for a series here. So we'll start with first with modified swimming. Legs are straight. Your feet are turned out so your big toe is on the mat. Your arms come out in front, but if you have tight shoulders, you can bring them to a goal post. Head hovers, looking right down at your mat. Feel your belly button to your spine. Take an inhale, and then exhale, lift right arm, left leg. Inhale, return. Exhale, left arm, right leg. Inhale, return. Keep this going. Using that exhale to lift. Imagine somebody is pulling your arm out as well as your leg out for this opposing stretch. Good, and then you can just stay with this, or if you want to challenge yourself a little more to the full swimming, 
both arms come up, both legs come up, inhale, and then you just swim along. Breathing, swimming, belly button, spine, obliques engaged, feet are turned out. Inhale, exhale. One more inhale and exhale, release. Bring one hand on top of the other and you can just rest your forehead here. Your knees come wide and then touch your heels together. So it's like a reverse froggy. And it's just a muscle contraction here. So head rests on your hands. Take an inhale. And then as you exhale, squeeze the heels together and squeeze the glutes together. Inhale, relax. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale, relax. Exhale, squeeze. Just keep this going. Doing a few more. If you want to challenge yourself a little more on your next squeeze, you can micro lift those thighs off the mat. And you would inhale, return. Exhale, squeeze and lift. And if you feel that in your low back, just stick with the squeeze and no lift. And just doing a few more. Squeeze and maybe lift. Squeeze and lift. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. Squeeze it in. Relax. Legs come long. Then push yourself into a child's pose. Take a couple resting breaths here. Inhale. Exhale. One more inhale. And exhale, just rising up. Coming onto a seat. And we're going to do the obliques roll back. So feet are on the ground, tall spine, arms out in front parallel. Take an inhale and exhale, squeeze those glutes, rolling halfway back, open that left arm, follow it with your eye. Inhale, return, stack that spine. Exhale, squeeze, come back, opening to the right. Inhale, return, stack that spine. Exhale, squeeze, open to the left. Inhale, we return, stack that spine. Exhale, squeeze, roll back, open up to the right. Inhale, come back, stack that spine. Exhale, come down, open to the left. Inhale, return. Stack that spine. Last one. Exhale. Squeeze. Come back. Open to the right. Inhale. Come back. Stack that spine and relax. And you're going to come onto your side for a leg series. So you'll cradle your head and the arm. First line up your body and then bring your feet to that front corner of your mat. This arm acts as a tripod. As you start losing your balance, just bend this bottom leg to help support. Bring that top leg hip height, flex the foot. It's gonna come forward twice in front of your body, then point that toe, bring it behind your body. So it's flex, flex forward, then point and comes back. Flex, flex, point. Flex, flex, point. So inhale, exhale. Just keep this going as I give you some reminders. 
You want to try and keep that leg hip height the whole time. You want to keep that pelvis stable, so it shouldn't really be going with that leg very much. And this top shoulder, you want to keep away from your ear. Flex, flex, forward. Flex, flex, point it back. Two more. Flex, flex, point. Last one. Flex, flex, point. Good, relax that leg. Straighten out your body. Again, you can bend this bottom leg to help support you. And then we're just lifting that top leg and lowering it. As we lift, point that toe. As we lower, flex that foot. Point, flex, point, flex. Keep that going. Inhale, exhale. Two more. Point as it comes up, flex as it comes down. Point, flex. Last one. Point and flex. Good. Moving into staggered legs, take an inhale. Bring your top leg hip height. Exhale. Inhale, get ready. Then exhale, bottom leg matches the top leg and then they both come down. So it's lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. And really tighten into those obliques to keep you from rocking back and forth. Lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. Two more. Lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. Last one. Lift, lift, lower. Good. Bring that top leg hip height. Point that toe. Ten times circles. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Other way. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax that leg. Bend your knees. Bring them in front of you. Working into the clams. Take an inhale. Exhale, open up those legs, keep the heels together. Inhale, return. Exhale, they open. Keep that going. So you can hold your waist if you don't want to go with that leg. So keep that waist where it is, just moving that leg. Exhale, they open. Two more. One last one. And return. We're going to work that uh, stretch of that leg out that just did all the work. So come onto your back. The leg that just did the work, cross it over to the other thigh. Staying here or pulling that knee into your chest and taking some deep breaths. Inhale, feel your ribs expanding. And then exhale, release. Before we move on to the other side, we're gonna do a little plank series. So whenever you need to, just go onto your knees. Otherwise, we're gonna start first with a straight arm plank. So wrist right under your shoulders, spread those fingers, and when you're ready, come up. And bring your feet just slightly apart. You can just hold here, or if you wanna challenge yourself, you can go with that right leg, and then the left leg, keeping that pelvis still and stable. Look right at the mat. 
Use that exhale to lift. So one more right. One more left. Drop to your knees. Just sit back on your heels and just shake that out. So we'll move on to a forearm plank. And again, options to lift the legs if you want to. If you feel anything in this lower back at any point, come down to your knees. So grab your fist, line up those um, elbows and your shoulders. And when you're ready, come on up. Either just holding it, or you can lift the right leg, and then the left. Right, left, right, and left. One more each side. Right, and left. And then carefully come down to your knees, rest in child's pose, but this time bring your arms by your side. And just take a few resting breaths. Inhale. And we'll use that exhale to just slowly come up. We're going to work the other side of your leg. So you're just going to bring your head to the opposite side. It was just that. So you'll cradle your head and your arm. Line your body up straight first. Then bring your legs to the front corner of the mat. Again, you can bend this bottom leg for support. Top leg hip height. Kick it forward twice. Then it comes behind your body. Flex, flex, point. Flex, flex, point. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Flex, flex, point. Keep that leg hip height. Drop that shoulder down. Flex, flex, point. Two more, flex, flex, point, flex, flex, point. Good, relax, straighten yourself up. Again, bend that bottom leg as needed. And then we lift and lower, point as you come up, flex as you come down, lift, lower, lift, Lower, inhale, exhale. Two more, lift, lower, inhale, exhale. Last one, lift and lower. Good. Moving into staggered legs. So flex the feet, top leg hip height. Take an inhale. Exhale, bottom leg matches it and they both come down. Lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. Lift, lift, lower. Drop your shoulder down. Keep this going. Try to engage those quads. Lift, lift, lower, two more. Lift, lift, lower, last one. Lift, lift, lower. Bring your top leg hip height, point that toe, 10 tiny circles. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, other way. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, relax. Bend knees, bring them in front of your body for clams. 
Take an inhale. Exhale, open, keep those heels together. Inhale, return. Exhale, open. Inhale, return. Hold your waist so your pelvis doesn't go with you. Drop that shoulder. Two more. Last one. Relax. Let's stretch this leg out. Come onto your back. Cross that ankle on your thigh. And then bring that into your chest. And breathe. Inhale, three bands to the rib. Exhale, release. Coming onto your seat, doing some hip raises. So your hands, fingers face your toes. The tendency here is to round the shoulders. So we're gonna try and keep that heart open. Take an inhale, and then exhale, lift those hips, Break the toes, lift the heart, and then line up your head. Inhale, exhale, hinge down. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, lift hips, point toes, lift heart, head in line. Inhale, exhale, come down. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, lift up. Make one long line, inhale, exhale, come back down. One more, take an inhale, exhale, lift, point those toes, lift your heart, head in line. Inhale, exhale, come back down. Then bring your legs slightly apart, hands in front of you. Feel your spine nice and tall, forward fold. So inhale, just nod your head. Exhale, begin to walk those fingers out, allowing a curve to the spine, folding into this. Inhale. Then exhale, walk the hands back and feel that spine stacking, shoulders back. Inhale, nod your chin. Exhale, walking out. Inhale, stay here. Exhale, walk it back. One more. Inhale, nod your head. Exhale, walk it out. Inhale, stay. Exhale, walk it back. Good. Then come onto your back for a twist. So just arms out to a T. Knees are together. And then drop those knees to your left side. And then pick up the hip on the ground. Pick it up and move it towards the middle of your mat. Then allow the knees to fall. Look the opposite way of your knees. Melt your shoulders. And breathe. Nice deep breaths. Inhale, and then exhale, coming onto your back, lining that spine up again. Drop your knees to the right, and again with this bottom hip, lift it up and move it about two inches back to the middle. Then look the opposite way of your knees. Find a soft gaze and just breathe. Nice, deep, and long, intentional breaths.
inhale, feel that expansion. Exhale, release onto your back. Just squeeze those knees into your chest, rock them a little side to side. And then just coming into tabletop, <coughs> starting to wind down. And we'll do some cat cows. <coughs> So wrists under your shoulders, knees under your hips. Inhale, you're gonna lift that heart. Exhale, start from the base of that spine, curving into the belly, the ribs, the lungs, trying to be heavy. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, tuck. Inhale, uncurl. Exhale, you tuck. One more. Inhale, uncurl. Exhale, tucking. And then return back to tabletop. Give yourself a child's pose. Stretching fingers, arms, resting that forehead. Inhale deeply, exhale it all out. Inhale, exhale. And then one more inhale here. And then exhale, just stacking your spine to a seated position. And just coming back to how we started with some breathing. So just rest the sit bones, relax the legs, spine is tall. Drop the shoulders, gentle tug to the top of the head. Either close your eyes or find a soft gaze. Inhale, allow that belly, ribs, chest to expand. Exhale it out through your mouth. Inhale deeply. This time exhaling through your nose. Inhale, feel that expansion. Exhale, feel that release. Inhale, feel that air, bringing all of your body energy, fresh energy. And exhale, any remaining tension out. And begin to just let your breath settle, slowing it down. See if you can relax your legs a little more. Feel that spine tall. Shoulders broad and relaxed. The muscles in your face are relaxed. Just breathing with your body. Noticing the pulses that are going through it. Softening. Releasing. And then we'll take a nice deep inhale here. Exhale, relax. And then just opening your eyes, coming back to the space, and just noticing how you feel. Thank you all so much for joining me. I hope you have a fabulous day or a fabulous evening. Namaste.